first of all, you're going to need to log in. And if you haven't already created an account, you'll need to sign up. But once you've logged in, so now I can tell I'm logged in if it's showing my name or some identifier in the upper right hand corner. The next thing I want to do is go to graphing calculator. Click on that. Now that you have this awesome graph, you want to save it so that you can share it with other people or reference it yourself later in case you've done something you think you might want to do again. Really simple. Click on the save, the green save button in the upper left hand corner, and it will give you a box here where you can type in the title. So I'm going to call this my awesome graph. When I click save, it's saved, and you see now it has the title. Click in the upper left hand corner where it says has three horizontal bars. You'll notice I have a lot of saved graphs, and you will eventually as well. If you want to share this with someone else, there's a share graph button. Now, this only shows up if you're in desktop view. But if you're not in desktop view, if you're on a mobile device, you can usually still access the desktop view for this purpose. So click here where it says has a, a, an arrow with jumping out of a square. Click on that and you want to copy this link. See how I have a check mark? That means it's copied. Now, if I need to paste this in an email or put it in a web work box, I can. 